onto the medical school quota expansion issue. A dispute looks to be emerging within the medical community, seeking a unified voice for dialogue with the government. In the meantime, more medical schools have resumed classes. Ian Yi has more. Amidst the ongoing dispute between the government and the medical community, another wave of conflicting voices has emerged. On Sunday, the Korean Medical Association's Emergency Committee described last week's meeting with President Yoon suk yeol as a meaningful encounter. The committee also announced that the Korea Medical Association, professors, trainee doctors and medical students will speak with a collective voice from now on and will be holding a joint press conference later this week. However, on Monday, Park Dan, the head of the Korean Intern Resident Association, emphasized via social media that no such agreement has been reached. Also, the next head of the KMA, Lee m y o n t a e k whose term is set to begin next month, has stepped forward, expressing his intention to take up the position earlier than planned. This comes as the result of contrasting views when it comes to the medical school quota expansion, as Im is known for his strong stance against the government. Currently, the Korea Medical Association is operating under the leadership of the Emergency Response Committee. With the medical community divided, dialogue between the government and the medical community could become more challenging. The government, still highlighting the need to increase the medical school quota by 2,000 places, remains open to discussions about alternative solutions supported by scientific evidence and logical reasoning. Meanwhile, as of Tuesday, the Ministry of Education confirmed that 16 out of the 40 medical schools nationwide have started classes. Additionally, the majority of the remaining 24 schools are also planning to begin classes within this month. Based on the regulation that requires at least 30 weeks of lectures annually, the university said they could not delay the academic schedule any farther. However, the attendance of medical students who have applied for leaves of absence remains uncertain, comprising 55% of enrolled students, while practical classes for third- and fourth-year students mostly held offline still face challenges. Lee Eun-hee, Arirang News.